happening right now. Metro Council members voting to decide who should be on Nashville's first community oversight board, which will look into alleged police misconduct. New Channel 5 has covered this process from the beginning, and our Kelsey Gibbs has been listening in all evening long. Kelsey, nearly four hours later, how many people have been selected? Well, this is what we know so far that there are there's three phases of this voting and right now the council is in phase two. We just learned that former Nashville police chief Emmett Turner has been elected in that phase. Now he will join phase one members Jamil Campbell Goosh, Ashley Davis, Andres Martinez and Brenda Ross. Now, they were all elected to be members of the oversight board. Now we interviewed two of the newest members just minutes after learning that they were nominated. I mean, it feels amazing, you know, uh, it feels amazing because I think this is an opportunity that our community gets a chance to build relationships that are not present right now. This is amazing. It's a great honor, but an immense responsibility. And I'm just really excited and uh, quite humbled. Now, these four members of the Oversight Board will join the mayor's nominees, Phyllis Hildreth and Bob Cooper. Their job will consist of investigating allegations of misconduct by the Metro Nashville Police Department. And the board must be established by January 31st. Now, again, the council is in the second phase of voting, which is um, they will select three candidates that nominated by a community organization or a petition that have not been selected in phase one. And phase three will follow that, and that was when they will select two candidates who have been nominated by the Metro Council members. We just learned that James Shaw Jr. did not receive a vote. But for now, we are live at Metro Council Chambers, Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.